Welcome to Mystical Bliss Heartlights. It has been a long time. Most of you here, you know me as Patrick or Yenga, and most of you are actually activated Heartlights. So I don't remember exactly, but it must have been somewhere in 2007, 2008, that I was called by the Council of Heartlights to activate humans who were on their journey, who were seekers, who wanted to be part of the shift and the transformation that already was starting to gearing up at that time. And so I started doing that. I traveled with people to the Council of Heartlights and different activations were made. But mainly, the main thing was to activate that light in the heart and that light pulse. And then for many years, there was nothing. We had groups, we were a weekly meeting, we did all kind of good stuff, and then the Council of Heart Lights was actually very quiet. And it's just recently that they have really come back to me and say, hey, we got some more work for you. So let's do it. Once a week, I will post here a journey to the Council of Heartlights. If you are not familiar with it or if you have forgotten it. So the Council of Heartlights is a high council of light that helps humanity at the moment to, or in general, it helped us for a long time, to get aligned to the energy of the light pulse that is actually residing in our heart. And that light pulse is connecting us to the whole universe. It is also helping us to, to dance through all these new shifts that are occurring. So it's interesting, it was towards 2012 and now into 2020 and what follows up from there. And it gives us some tools to to understand the situation, to stay calm, to, to shift our consciousness really. With this pulse of light that we are receiving and whatever else they are giving us, we are actually able to stay in the pulse of everything. So when you think about the earth that is really also recapitulating, that is shifting that is on that planetary ascension there is a pulse to it this pulse is maybe not physical but many of us can actually feel it and that pulse is similar to the light pulse that you have in your heart so it helps us to synchronize with the earth too and go through that shift through that ascension process together so that is the talking part of it. And I just want to invite you now to join me on this journey to the Council of Heartlights. It will be an update. This is what I'm getting right now, what comes after. Let's see. It will be an update to the light pulse that you already have in your heart, if you have it already. And for those who don't, obviously you will get an activation of your light pulse. Now, Many people work in different regions and different planets. There's a lot of Sirius, there's Lyra, there's all these Arcturians. My particular calling was actually always with the Southern Cross. Connected to the Inca Cross, I don't know, but I feel that most of the work that comes through the Council of Heartlight is actually through the Southern Cross. If you're living in the Southern Hemisphere, you might be, might be able to see it in the night sky. If not, check it. Google it, they say, and maybe you find how beautiful the Southern Cross looked. The Southern Cross also had a big significance in the whole spirituality of the Inca. As it was a sign of the four seasons, the four elements, and of course the beautiful thing about a Chacana which is kind of the representation of the Southern Cross, is the hole in the center. So the idea was that 
when you understand all the threes and the fourth of life, the physical, you actually can go through the empty space. So let me invite you to a journey to the Council of Heart Lights and the Southern Cross. So I'm inviting you to either sit or lie down. If you're sitting, you can either cross your legs or put them firmly on the ground. And just for a moment, arrive to yourself. Just arrive. Inhale and exhale. Become present to your breath. Imagine on every inhale, you're inhaling beautiful white light. And on your exhale, you release all the colors that you don't need at this moment. Inhaling peace and releasing your stress, your conflicts, your thoughts. Inhaling stillness and exhaling confusion and emotions just becoming still relaxing very deep your focus to your sacred heart which is the third level of your heart if your heart light was activated focus on that heart light that light pulse. If you haven't had an activated heart light, just stay in heart, that diamond shape, also known as the cosmic heart. And imagine you can take that outside of your body. around you as this heart of yours or your, your heart light draws a little bit further from you. Many other heart lights are joining or hearts. Imagine this circle gets bigger and bigger. More and more heart lights and sacred hearts are joining in. As 
all of them have joined. A torus is forming as the vehicle of travel to the Southern Cross and the Council of Heart Lights. So imagine now this Taurus has in it all those heart lights and hearts that have joined in this space today, becoming this wonderful Taurus. And this Taurus is like a light ship now that is shimmering out into the universe. And to the Council of Heartlights. Imagine this Taurus is landing. And as it is landing, you're taking out your heart light or your heart. This is a very high dimensional place of the seventh or ninth dimension, however you are able to perceive it. The waters are crystalline the colors of energy available through the eyes everywhere. Imagine you are taking on a luminous body, a very light body. And all of us are walking for a while by this crystalline ocean The Southern Cross is a place to go beyond dimensions and time. A place where communication gets translated into different vibrations of the highest. And here already we're arriving at this place of the Council of Heartlights. You may imagine it as a temple or simply an open sacred space. The Council of Heartlights is taking us into the center imagine we're getting showered in beautiful light.
And so we are all being invited to get this latest upgrade and activation of our heart light that helps us to shine our truth, our vibration, our highest heart frequency into our world and this universe. Oh la 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 isha toya karere oa ye ma yo Chantina marananda rinda 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 roa ke la le 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 la lo la re Kona ma kona Ma li lo la li linda re le linda ka la ke la lo la linda lo la 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 le 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 yo la kia ma ne kia na me ha yo so feel that light shining now very bright in your heart. And now they are giving us the pulse of light. straight from the source of light from T, the pulse of light, the pulse of life. That life beyond death, that infinite life, as you are imagining to hold your newfound heart light we're activating now with the council of heart lights the light pulse kantore shendra indira kaishara madho kaniya badere ndere itare kendera itara kaneya matishitara nene ukaya matiya mashintaro ekaya yatata Enjoy the slight pulse. Feel that pulse of light and love through you. Let it embody. Let it integrate fully. Fully connect with this slight pulse. Council of Heart Lights today wants you to remember who you are. That soul, that spirit that has come at this time to contribute for a new world, to learn and to be of service. So please remember who you are and who you are becoming. Patori kantira enda kotari mateshenda rorora re ashui makeya naranderi iwa kishakiya mata 
anura mare kero na she shukundi kare lai la la lai ampiro kara patika yusha dira ma ekina mare kea shotata kalti ama klo ya mate kaishata kashtu ya mate keke u akia na te se mantiro ra she mantiro ma she u kuya ma ya 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 Eshte manen nane ya tora rea o. Eshte makora rea tora rea o. Taro makiana, taro mekayana, taro mekiano. Charo mekana nane nene o haramena, charo mekane atero mea. Beloved heart light, remember who you are. Remember who you are becoming. Remember your light. Remember your pulse of light, your truth. Remember how to express your truth. Chandi porendere candi rora piano, candi porendane candi comendane capiano, annero. Installing your becoming into your here and now, into your pulse of light and your heart light. Oya, 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 ne marare, oya, oya, taria maioa, eia tora, eia eia lora, eia tora, teia eia eia mea, mea 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 toria e, mea 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 toria e, toa e o, mia e mare. Takiyo, takiyo, nya. Remembering who you are. Installing these parts of you becoming that you're needing at this moment. And the Council of Heart Lights is now finishing the ceremony with us. As we are attuned to the highest heart light available at this moment, to the highest pulse of light and pulse of life, and slowly remembering who we are available to us the programs of who we are becoming and so we are leaving this sacred space and we're making our way back to the ocean where we walked and to that place where the Taurus released all of our heart lights at this time now our heart lights all together are forming a circle again and this circle is creating a beautiful Taurus blessings to all of you that are here today to take that step. And as we are forming this Taurus again, we are shimmering out again into the universe. 
and making our way back in this virtual space that connects us all. And as the Taurus disappears and your heart lights are coming out, let us be grateful for each other for this journey today. Thank you for stepping up to be on this journey, to reclaim your heart light and your light pulse, and for those who are new, to step into this amazing experience together. Imagine now your heart light is coming back into your own body. Allow it to settle, allow it to integrate. Allow it to shine. Let this pulse of light and pulse of life emanate in your whole body and beyond. And then bring your consciousness back into the here and now. Move your fingers, move your toes and slowly come back. Blink your eyes open. Thank you for being here. Thank you for this amazing update. There's plenty of things I have experienced, obviously, and I hope so have you. Would love to hear it either in the comments or in a personal message. Me too will share with you in the comments. For today, blessings into your world. Thank you for this new group, this new tribe of Heartlights. And let us work together. Let us be together for this whole new world. From my heart to yours. See you soon.